guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to do a little review of Glossier's two newest products. Um, they just recently released, There's, I assume there will be more eventually, but they're starting a body line. Um, and included in the body line, which is called Body Hero, um, is the Daily Perfecting Cream. Which is basically just a very moisturizing lotion. Um, and also the Daily Oil Wash which is supposed to be used in the shower. So I'm just gonna do a quick little review of these two products. I've been using them for about a week now, I'd say. Um, I'm just gonna tell you the pros and cons, so if that sounds interesting, please keep watching. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the Daily Oil Wash. Uh, first of all, the packaging of these two are amazing. I They're adorable. Um, not that I expected any less from Glossier, but they do look a little bit different than their other things, but they still look on brand, and I love it. Um, Start with the pros, because honestly this wasn't a winning product for me. Um, the pros, I really like the idea of an oil wash in the shower. Um, I have pretty dry skin, so the idea of moisturizing in the shower, which a shower usually, especially in the winter, I take warmer showers, it kind of, my skin feels kind of stripped. Um, so this is a nice way to add moisture so you don't feel just so parched when you get out. Um, it lathers up really nicely. It spreads really easily, so you really don't have to use that much over your whole body. Um, although this is quite a large bottle. Uh, it, what is the, let's see, 8.4 fluid ounces. Um, but yeah, it is, I was surprised when I pulled these out of the box how big they were, um, and a little goes a long way, so this will last you quite a long time and also it does leave your body feeling very clean which you know you would hope <laughs> it seems like a pretty basic thing but I thought I'd mention it it does work very well and it feels very nice um so you're probably wondering what is the con um I am not a fan of the scent that they chose for this it's definitely not a deal breaker for other people but for me it is it's I don't know exactly what the smell is it is very floral and it's a very strong floral um which is not my favorite scent i can actually god i can smell it in the bottles not even open <laughs> um yeah i just the second i opened it and i smelled it, i was like oh no oh no i'm not gonna like this but i still i tried it a couple times and i just couldn't it just sat in my shower so i only use this a few times um and it's really, it's, it's such a pity because it does really work very well and it feels really nice. And I, I was hoping that maybe if I could get over the smell in the shower, I could continue to use it. But it does stick to your skin a little bit. Um, it is very perfumey. It doesn't last all day, but I'd say like two hours or so. And I just, I just couldn't do it. I was really surprised with the scent because based on... The other things that Glossier has chosen to scent, all those scents have been very basic, um, like their Balm.coms, um, you know, it's very, it's coconutty, it's, it smells like mint, it smells like cherry, it's very simple, um, and even like the Milky Jelly Cleanser is very lightly rose fragrance, and I really like that. So I was, I was really surprised <laughs> that this was just so heavily scented perfumey I think would be the best word. I just want to put that out there because I feel like that was not mentioned in their advertising at all that it was scented so it was definitely a really big surprise for me. Um, so anyway if you really like florally scents um, or if scent doesn't really bother you and you're just looking for a good product I still recommend this. Functionality wise it works perfectly just like any other Glossier product. Alright so next is the Daily Perfecting Cream, and I really, really like this, which is great, because not a huge fan of the oil. <laughs> um, but scent-wise, we'll just go into that first. Scent-wise, this smells great. Um, it barely has a scent at all. It really, really lightly smells like floral, but it's like nowhere near this, and it's really more on par with their other products. Like, if it's at all scented, it's going to be very basic, very light, and unobtrusive. Um, I have used this after getting out of the shower. I've used this later in the day. Um, I've used it just on my hands. I've used it on my whole body. Um, it's really multifunctional. Um, I I mean it's, it's a huge container which is amazing but it is is really nice. It is 
very thick the consistency is really thick and it feels so moisturizing um it's like it's like I can't think of anything else to sound gross, but it's like the texture of like butter, but it absorbs into your skin. Um, it does take a minute to absorb like most moisturizing lotions. Um, so if you're really in a hurry, it may not be for you, but also I don't know if any lotion is for you, maybe an in-shower lotion. Um, but it doesn't take any longer than like a good sunscreen does to absorb. So I usually put it on after I get out of the shower and then continue to do my you know, my face and my skincare, and by the time I'm done with that, it's absorbed. Um, you probably brush your teeth and it would be absorbed. Uh, but anyway, I absolutely love this. I've definitely noticed a difference in my skin. Um, and this is a really good time to have a moisturizer like this, or lotion, sorry. Um, with fall coming, it's starting to get a little colder, um, and I mean, anyone's skin is affected, but especially those with combination of dry skin, you start to get those dry patches, and this is already helping me. So you can purchase these as a set. You can, of course, save some money. Um, and if you want to save even more money, if you watched my videos before, you know that I am a Glossier rep. So if you go to the link right here in front of me, you can save 20% off after already saving. So do that if you want. If you don't, that's fine. <laughs> I really hope, I know they've come out with different scents of things like the bomb.com. I hope maybe someday they'll come out with like an unscented version of this because I would buy that up in a heartbeat because this does feel really nice and it, it really is a huge tragedy. <laughs> also, I just realized I forgot to mention, um, oops, wrong one. <laughs> I forgot to mention a pro about this is I did try using it out the other day um, instead of a shaving gel and it works really well. Um, and putting this on after you shave, to help protect from razor burn. They both work, so multifunctional products as well. All right guys, so that's it for my review. It's kind of short. Um, I only was able to try it out for a, for a week or so, so I can only say so much. Um, if you have any questions, if there's anything, anything I missed, um, please let me know. You can leave a comment down below or you can follow me on Instagram. You can send me questions there. Um, so yeah, thanks so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. And please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time. Thanks.